welcome to Season 3. Um, today we're going to talk about quite a few things. So one of my projects that I've been working on is this project called Aim High or Stay at the Bottom. See, a lot of people don't want to stay at the bottom. They want to aim high. They want to get to their goals. They want to get to success. But they cannot get to success because they aren't willing to start. So if you're not going to aim high and you're not going to start, then you might as well just stay at the bottom and continue to feed on all the bottom and all of the things that are at the bottom. See, part of my philosophy is that if you really want something, you'll go after it, you'll get it. This is a new journey for me because before I've worked um, for someone, and today, you know, I'm making that trip, and I'm saying, today, I'm going to focus on being positive and the person that I really want to be because the person that I want to be wants to help others, and I can't help others when I'm working for somebody else. Uh, they take too much of my time, they take too much of my ability to focus on others who really need my help. So today I'm speaking out and saying I'm going to aim high, I'm going to set the bar, I'm going to go after it, I'm going to shoot for the stars because I do not want to stay at the bottom and I do not want to be paid for the time that I am giving to somebody else for little value. I believe I am valuable. I'm more valuable than anybody can believe that I am. And that's the goal and that's the mindset that I have set for myself. So reach high, reach higher than ever before and if you can, you will believe in yourself a little bit more every single day. See, really, it's all about attitude. It's all about how you perceive things. See, attitude really is how you perceive things. You're a matter of perspective. If your perspective isn't to go after your goals or to aim higher and that there's positivity in the lane or there's positivity in the course of where you would really want to be, then you're not going to go after and you're not going to achieve. See, I've always been positive. You know, being positive is just a part of who I am. My optimism is really what grows my ability to be successful. Everybody always asks me, why am I so positive? Why am I so into believing that things are better than what they really are? And the, and the short answer for that is really, I come from a background that has really just showed that some things aren't positive, but if you look at them in a positive manner, some things will turn into positivity. You just have to wait on it and you have to be patient. See, patience is one of my very best traits, and it's something that you, with a little coaching, a little nurturing, can really grow into achieving a better patient state and a better perspective towards your attitudes, okay? So that's what we're going to work on. We're going to aim high because we want to be successful. We have goals. We have things that we really want to attain. And you'll see me looking back and forth because I'm at Starbucks. Uh, and I'm here just working on a few things the old-fashioned way. You got to write it down. You got to put it in a notepad. You got to write down your notes. You got to make sure that you're passionate about something and you really believe in yourself and you don't want to depend on your brain because there's so much going on up here, then you have to go out and you have to achieve it the way that you set out to achieve it. And I believe in you. Just like there are plenty of other people that tell you that you are destined for much more than where you are, you're settling and you shouldn't. You're much more valuable. You should believe more into yourself because all it takes is that one instance, that one. It just takes one instance for you to really go after it. And it's saying, I accept where I am, but I want more. I want to be better, I want to show better, I want to grow better, I want to give more, I want to give to people that have given to me, and I want to return as many favors as I possibly can, because so many people have looked out for me over my life, that I believe that if you look out for others, so many of the things that you really want, and that you really want to attain, will come to you in so many different fashions. I can attest to that. People have given it to me over the years, and so part of my mentality and part of my mindset is you have to give directly. You have to give back, and it speaks to me every single day. Every single day. There was a scripture uh, I was reading, I believe it's in 1 Timothy, and it talks about how a person can be young and they can be youthful with spreading wisdom and to not be afraid to grow who you are, to share the love of Christ and to share the love of giving and and believing in people because a lot of times we doubt ourselves oh, I'm too young I'm immature I don't have the work I, you know I, I don't have the experience you know but I have to work it I'm a hard worker I, I grow and I live and I, I choose to do much more than what I've done before so time to start now time to start believing in yourself you can do it I believe you can aim high you need to shoot for the stars jump over the moon believe in the galaxy of opportunities that are out there because so many people are unattaining them 
and you have to be one of those people that attain success. Okay? So I'm Darrell Willis. I'm signing off. Thank you for watching this video. It's just in five minutes. This is awesome. All right. Look forward to talk to you soon. Goodbye.